here. And on that note, I'd like to ask Vishal to come join us up here on stage. Thank you, Vishal. Thank you for recreating a lot of nostalgia for many people in this room and around the country. Please. So Vishal, you want to talk a little bit about the song as it was back then and what it was like doing it now? Yeah, I think um, it was year 1992 uh, when it was my first break and I was struggling in Bombay. I just shifted from Delhi. It was year 91 I shifted and uh, the serial was being made, uh, produced by NFDC at that time. And someone else was supposed to do this song, but at the last moment he backed out and Gulzar Sahib called me that we have to do a song, but it has to be recorded tomorrow and because it has to go on air day after. <laughs> <coughs> so it was a Sunday morning and, uh, you know, I went to his place and I played him some tunes and, uh, you know, he just, he, he's a genius master and he wrote this line, Chaddi Ben Ke Pool Khilai. And we recorded the song and the song was released and then it became like the big success. It was my first big success. This was your first uh, this song? This was my first song with Guldar Sahib. Bombay. And Bombay and with Guldar Sahib. And this became a big success. I remember on 26 January, the, you know, Ganatantra Divas Parade, there was a chhaki which had Chaddi Ben Ke Phool Khila. So it became like a national anthem in those days. And, uh, you know, and then my career started. Then Guldar Sahib gave me break in marches. And then, uh, you know, I became a composer and then director. And after 23 years, uh, when Amrita called me and said uh, that uh, we want you to do, revive that song again. And the situation was the same because I was going for my Rangoon shooting. <laughs> and I had only one day to re-record that song. And then Guldas Sahib and me, and we met and uh, we did this. And I'm so happy that, you know, it was, it's again being liked by people. And I remember one, one thing, yes, uh, that uh, when it was released in 1992, uh, you know, a friend of mine called me from um, Bhopal. He said, you know, the RSS Shakha uh, behind their uh, home, in the morning they sing this song in their morning uh, uh, Chaddi Ben Kipul. Chaddi Ben Kipul. Because <laughs> <laughs> it was moved Chaddi a long time and, now, yeah, so. <laughs> and it was Kamal Kapoor. So, you know, so uh, this, I, I remember so much and uh, so I thought it's worth mentioning today. That's incredible. <laughs> so Neil, it's, it's, it's not a song you ever heard, right? But I heard that your, your mom heard it when, I mean, when, when she was in India, isn't that? Yeah. 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 So, I mean, it's something that, you know, so, so many people in India have grown up on and, you know, those, like Priyanka was saying, the show that used to come on on Sunday mornings. Uh, I'd like to open it up to Q&As now. I know that Neil's Trying to answer some questions. Yeah. <laughs> and Neil is so cute in the film. I Thank wish you, you don't so go. <laughs> uh, Vishal ji. Vishal ji. Here. Vishal ji. Oh, oh, uh. Vishal ji, which uh, was the original song that you made, so the words were different. और इसमें बदलाव किया गया हालांकि ये बोल भी बहुत खूबसूरत है लेकिन ये क्यों चेंज किया गया उसमें बहुत अच्छे मुझे लगा कि 23 साल में हम लोग भी ग्रो करने चाहिए वी शुड डू समथिंग न्यू सो दैट वाज द रीजन तो ये ये जो सॉन्ग है ये भी गुलजार जी ने ही लिखा है जी 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 और एंड आई मीन इट्स रियली अनफॉर्चूनेट ही कुडंट जॉइन अस टुडे ही इज सेंट हिज विशेस टू अस एंड ही जस्ट गॉट बैक फ्रॉम ढाका from a week long trip and he said he uh, you know he he would have loved to be here siddharth ji aapse bhi ek sawal karna tha ki ye film bachcho ke liye bani hai itni badi itni bhavya film aur wo bhi hamare desh ki film ise ua certificate diya gaya to uska aapne virodh kyun nahi kiya kyunki ye film hi bachcho ke liye hai to usko ua certificate kyun diya gaya you know actually uh, film to bachcho ke liye hai there's no doubt about it but it's also for families and i think uh, you know we wanted to retain the sanctity of the film and ensure that we didn't have to cut the film at all from exactly the way that it that that we would like it to be seen and unfortunately i, I think for a u certificate we might have had to do that so i think what we figured is that families will be able to come and watch it parents and kids will be able to come together and watch it and we'd like the film to be you know kept uh, you know exactly as it is so that's why. But I have seen the film. There is nothing which which asks for a U.S. certificate in this film. It is such a beautiful film. 
I mean, there's there's nothing which which is going to scare kids or you know. Yep. No. Nope. I so, mean, it's a it's it's a kids' film through and but through. But let's accept this fact that we are these are the times that Jungle Book is being given U.A. <laughs> <laughs> Neil, this is a question for you. Hi. Hi. Uh, out of all the animals that you worked with, which one is your favorite? Well, I didn't work with the animals, but if I had to well, pick, okay. Yeah. Um, probably Baloo the bear, because he's so free spirited and laid back, laid back, and he like he cares, but he doesn't want to worry that much, and he's like all bear necessities and all happy and yay. <laughs> like he's like very calm. <laughs> Hi Neil. Uh, it's pretty amazing. I just just you know like before the next question. I mean the the reason Neil says he he didn't have to work with animals is because he really didn't. This was shot completely on you know I mean it was shot on blue screen and everything that you see in the film has actually been added in later. So that's the that's that's the amazing part about technology. Yeah. Hi Neil. Uh, this is Alok on your right. What's the reaction from your school friends after the first uh, promo trailer? Okay. Well. When I first went for the audition, I was end of elementary school, and our school basically split up into two schools. And all of my good and close friends all went to the same school as mine. And so when I got there, like late sixth grade, um, everybody knew me, everybody was still comfortable with me, because it was most of the same friends. And um, some of the new people, new friends, um, they think it's really cool. Everybody, most people think it's really cool, but they still, like, they're, they're not, they don't realize how big it is, but I'm happy about that. <laughs> so do you know about uh, Bollywood and your favorite actor, actresses, if you name? Huh. Well, I really, like, when I watch any, like, Indian movie or anything, it's just really cool. And it's, so, it's kind of different. I don't know. It just is. And I just really like it. Uh, hi, Sadat. Uh, yeah. Hi. Uh, my question is, how did you go about with the voice casting for the Hindi um, film and how important was it to get Nana Patekara Sher Khan again? You know, he was our first choice. So, I mean, just how we went about going, uh, how, how we really went about the voice casting was we decided that we really wanted to be able to cast known voices in each of these parts because each of these parts are so well known. We all know Balu, we know Bagheera, we know Ka, we know Sher Khan, we know King Louis. So we really wanted to be able to get uh, voices that we all recognize and love and enjoy to be able to go with each of these characters. And we made up our list. And we had obviously first choice, second choice, third choice. And thankfully, all our first choices, as soon as we approached them, said that they'd do it because they all love the Jungle Book. And just for them, like Priyanka was saying, to be able to voice Ka, just the fact that you know, you've grown up on this character, and now you can actually get to be their voice was something very special for them. Hi, Sadat. So that here, Hi. Manisha. In the in the old Jungle Book that we watched as kids, uh, there was another character called Rani, which I don't see in this one. So is the story the same, or is it slightly different from the? Uh, one? If you can just remind me, who was Rani? Was the uh, girl who comes from where the humans? So you'll have to watch the film to know whether there is a Rani in this or not. <laughs> okay, my question to Neil. Okay, uh, Neil, now that you're a star, are you treated any differently at home? Do you get a, a kind of a star treatment? <laughs> <laughs> not at all, not one bit. My sister will still be. So vehement no, and his parents are nodding. <laughs> very vehement no as well. <laughs> Especially my sister. She'll beat me to the ground. <laughs> hi, Siddharth. Uh, hi, Siddharth, towards your right. Oh, yeah. Hi. Uh, you know, like you said that Jungle Book, uh, like Jungle people have grown over Jungle Book in India. So, uh, and since it is a solo release on 8, so what uh, sort of release are you planning for the film in India? We're planning a very wide release. I, I don't have the exact number of screens really at this point, but it is going to be English, Hindi, Tamil and Telugu. And it's going to be a very, very wide release across the country because we think it's a film that's going to appeal to, you know, pretty much, you know, everyone. Uh, and one more question is, uh, you know, with Hollywood films doing well in India, do you think a time will come when Hollywood will take over, uh, take over Bollywood, like uh, across the globe the Hollywood film industry is doing? No, no, I don't think so. I think we, we love our movies, we, you know, we are, we are people who enjoy our stars, our stories, our grammar filmmaking. I, I don't think that day will ever come. What, what is happening is that a lot of Hollywood movies that we uh, like and enjoy are the ones where our, our cinema is not being able to give us that. So if it's something like a superhero film or a creature film or a disaster film or even a film like The Jungle Book, which is, you know, the sort of scale is so spectacular, hopefully Indian movies one day will be able to do the same. Siddharth, so this side, uh, just, you know, just to sort of uh, 
you know the, 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 another question related to that uh, is your marketing uh, you know and uh, you know the pnp budget is it sort of closer to what you would you know for this film closer to what it would be for an indian film i mean this is sort of like it is an indian film and yet it's not uh, so you know how do you sort of uh, how do you market it and you know um, is it something different that you're doing this time uh, yes it is so you know other than the fact that we can't go on reality shows and we can't uh, do city visits across the country pretty much everything else is like a hindi movie we're doing you know television and we're doing radio and we're doing you know uh, print and we we're, we're uh, doing a lot on digital media so there are so many things that we're doing that are exactly the way that we would market you know a local production uh hi neel uh, on your right actually this side so we see a lot of uh, obviously you did the entire film alone the entire yes. film you just the only person how much of acrobatics did you have to do i mean because we see a lot of jumping around what is just you jump from here to there or did you actually have to you know well it was hang all, yeah by the tree it was all like green screen blue screen which is the same thing um but i got trained in parkour which is like free running and like trying like basically it's running but like a cool way of running so like to get over stuff instead of like so like okay time out let me get over this tiger okay now continue it's like you like jump over it is really cool way. and it's really just me jumping from one like blue um blue shaded platform to another and then they make that look like it's a 400 400 feet drop and i think that's really cool cuz after i first first watched it i was like I'm cool. <laughs> Cuz it looked like it, I didn't really do that, but it looks like I did. So yeah, what's the I mean, okay, your friends obviously you being got to know about your school friends, but uh, girls are they impressed <laughs> that you can jump as much and parkour is interesting? I don't really care. <laughs> He's not quite at that age yet. <laughs> uh Siddharth, hi. Samne aapke जी इसके अलावा आपकी एक बहुत बड़ी फिल्म रिलीज हो रही है जगह जासूस लेकिन बार बार बहुत सारी प्रॉब्लम्स आ रही है कटरीना और रणवीर की ब्रेकअप की वजह से तो फिल्म कब तक रिलीज होगी और फॉरेन में शूट हो रहा है कि नहीं हो रहा है क्योंकि कई रिपोर्ट्स आ रहे हैं फिल्म को लेकर कुछ कहना चाहेंगे फिल्म के बारे में कि क्या है कब बनेगी कब सो फर्स्टली ये जंगल बुक की प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस है तो आई वुड लाइक टू टॉक अबाउट एनीथिंग एल्स बट सिंस यू रेज द क्वेश्चन यस द फिल्म इज प्रोग्रेसिंग वेरी वेल uh we are shooting overseas and uh, you know in 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 my experience uh when there's a lot that happens in the course of the making of a movie and there are ups and downs those movies usually turn out to be really good because that that shows the amount of effort that's gone into it sometimes the smoothest movie turns out not to turn out all that well so i i i don't think the process of the making of the movie has anything to do with the way the movie will finally turn out uh, yes it has been you know a while uh but uh, we're really happy with whatever that we're seeing and the footage is spectacular so i think anurag basu is someone who should be left alone to do what he does best neel hello yeah who is your favorite actor um i don't know i've never been asked that before um i i guess all the actors from the jungle book <laughs> he's learned diplomacy <laughs> Okay, we'll take one more question. Um hi, way at the back. All right, clearly VFX is the way forward. It's not only Jungle Book, but even in India, a film like Bahubali is winning the national award. What are your thoughts on it and um you know, VFX? No, I think VFX is very important as long as it's in the service of telling a great story. I think you've seen a lot of examples in, you know, in the past in in the recent past as well as you know years ago where vfx can't save a movie that doesn't have a great script but vfx can really enhance a story that that needs vfx to be able to aid in the storytelling i don't know if you want to add anything to that vishal yeah no and we are doing very good in vfx now we are improving uh, a lot very you know it's a very rapid growth and as siddhal said it should uh, enhance the storytelling absolutely and vishal sir of course mr bachchan has won the national award for the best actor for piku what are your thoughts on it I mean he's a great actor he's a legend what can i say Okay any Hi, more questions uh, for Neil one last question for Neil and then we'll wrap Okay Well i hope to do more i don't know yet but i have some stuff in the works Hi one more uh, no. okay, thank you <laughs>
दो बच्चे थे एक बच्चा था गौतम उसको मैं नहीं ढूंढ पा रहा हूँ बाकी दो तीन बच्चों को मैं ढूंढ पाया थैंक यू थैंक्स एवरीवन ये बैठ जाओ बैठ जाओ रे हां ले ये अरे रुक जाओ बता रही हैं वो उसकी मम्मी है कौन है कौन है बस रे For more news and gossip, don't forget to subscribe to Bollywood Helpline.